Welcome back heroes to some more Coromon. Last episode we won the mirror challenge. We got the scan module. We had to battle a copy of our team but they were all potent and our team managed to absolutely smash it. Defeat a team that is exactly the same as ours but stronger which was uh, really great. Made our way to the next town. On the way we ran into the Wabonians. We had to battle uh, pretty weak but luckily managed to do a Megalobite. Came in absolute clutch. Uh, we got a few chests on the way and now we have to try and talk to the sensei to get this uh, new module that should hopefully be able to break the, the rocks that have fallen in front of the mine. Then we get to the next titan. So in we go. And let's go and talk to the sensei. There you are. Hello. Hello Light Sensei. My name is Voltsy. I've come to request your aid. Uh, hello? <laughs> Light Sensei? Light Sensei is in deep meditation. Please don't disturb him. Oh, sorry, I didn't know. This looks like he's asleep. <laughs> oh, you awake now? Hey, oh, oh. It seems a guest has entered our midst. Greetings. Yes, Light Sensei. I'm Voltsy. I need your help. And what could an old man do for such a young person? The entrance to Mount uh, Muspel was completely blocked by a rock slide. The townspeople are requesting your help. Would you be able to break the boulder that's blocking the mine? Mm, the strong will forgive. The intelligent will ignore. Thus, I have already done both. But as much as my worldly desires flare, I'm afraid I can't help you. Oh, why not, man? Come on. Do you see this bonsai, Voltsy? It took years for this bonsai to grow large and sturdy. Yet, even after its long struggle to grow and thrive, one day, it will still wither. For me, that day has already arrived. I can no longer perform the Stonebreaker technique, as was my calling. Is there anyone else that could break the boulder? Not Daniel, to your right, but mmm. My students have not been brought up for the task. On one of my strolls through the forest, I found this sapling. It had delicate branches, but it seemed to have a solid, sturdy base. I gave it a chance, and from beneath its bewildered appearance rose a beautiful bonsai. Perhaps your bark is similar to that sapling's. If I could pass on the stonebreaker to a worthy individual before I get too old, my heart would be at peace. And then you could smash the boulder yourself. Sounds good. I feel like your disciple Daniel to your right is going to get a little bit jealous, no? But however, it is not that, not as simple as that. Since you haven't trained in my dojo before, you must realize this training will demand your mind and body to be at its peak. Anything worth doing is difficult, Light Sensei. Yes, that is very true. Please leave some wisdom for your elders. The journey of a thousand mile begins with a single step, so we must best start stepping. Young one, you know where the reflex pole is stored? Can you grab it for me? Uh... I... yeah, where is it? Were you talking to me? Daniel, pay attention. Even when you think nobody pays attention to you. <laughs> Apologies. I'll set up the reflex pole right away. Right, so the stone breaker is not something to be used anywhere. But when things go wrong, one needs to be capable of handling its consequences. So the first discipline you will have to master is reflexes. Daniel, give me a number. Uh, 22? 22. That is as good as a number as any. 22 it is, Voltsy. 22 what? He who thinks too much about every step he takes will always stay on the leg, or stay on one leg. If you're in the right mindset, try and give me a high five. Training will begin when our hands touch. Okay. Mist, come now. Just an old man. Mist, wait, what? Do, do I need to keep going? Oh, there you go. <laughs> Clear your mind. Focus your mind. Feel, use your senses. Surrender your body to the world around you, and your reflexes will increase a thousandfold. Find the pattern and timing. Clear 22 jumps. Oh, that was terrible. Failure is the mother of success, Voltsy. So come, try again. Fortune favors the bold, Voltsy. You declare 22 jumps. Okay, let's try this again. Clear your mind, focus your mind, feel, use your senses. Surrender your body to the world around you. Here we go. Oh, it's too... Okay. Score of seven. Impressive. You almost broke Daniel's record. <laughs> He's like, whoa, what? All right. I'll try again. This is going to be tough. All right. Oh. Give me the high five. There you go. <laughs> right. If I don't do it this time, I'll cut to when I do it. Because this is... It like changes speed.
And it slows back down, which really throws me off. They kept the same speed. Oh, I've done it. I didn't realize I did that many. Then keep going. Yeah. Absolutely smash it. 22? I did more. Got 50. I wonder if it goes to like the 100. Oh, never mind. I'm not going to find out. <laughs> Score of 56. Patience is a bitter plant, but its fruit is often the sweetest. You have learned to jump, and we may teach you how to run. In a sense. Okay. The next trainer will improve your dexterity. Meet me in the arcade hall on the top floor of Vlamma's uh, trainer hub. I'll race you there. Okay. Well, let's just uh, use the Lux Recall. Uh, we will go to this one. Ooh. Shortcuts BB. See, I feel like I remember one of them being catch a certain Koro one. Not sure if they've changed it or not, but I did not like it before because I think I, I'm pretty sure I had to find a potent one. Let's uh, talk to you. Foltzy, I've been expecting you. Okay, oh. And thus, it is here that my journey ends. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to distract you. No worries, Foltzy. It's not your fault. Playing games is not about the high score, but the journey to reach that point. I know you could achieve an even higher score than I once and then I once you set your mind to it. All right, this trainer will teach you hand-eye coordination and perseverance. A metaphor for the challenges one must face when using the Stonebreaker. I won't disappoint you, Light Sensei. Disappointment only comes while giving up. Reach your score 250. Uh, give it your greatest again and again, Voltsy. Well, I got like 641 last time I did this, so... Should be easy. Get to listen to the great music. <laughs> Oh, I love this. All right, 50 down. Only 200 more to go. Let's keep it going, let's keep it going. Jump again, almost at 100. And we have just about hit 100. 150 to go. It's time to see the sliver pins. Jump over you, jump over you. About to get 150, almost halfway. That's about over halfway, actually. It's 125, it's halfway, but 100 more to go. Well, that's than 100. Oh, almost at 200. There we go, 50 more. We got this, we got this. So jump, and jump, and 50, done. All right, so there you go. Don't need to play again, got 250. I did it, I beat the high score. Uh, persistence always wins in the end. You can even impress with your progress, Faulty. Like the tender sapling, you have strong roots hidden beneath. Yeah, I try. But your training is not quite over yet. You must return home for the grand finale. Let's meet in front of the dojo. Wanna race again? Well, I can't teleport there, I don't think. Oh, that's cheating. <laughs> I have to run. I don't think there's a teleporter there anyway. I could always check, but... Uh, can we... No, yeah, we can't go up there. That's cheating, man. It's cheating. We can just pop a scent though, run back real quick. Although, I'm fairly certain. Um, I forget what you check. Is it the database? I swear there's like a fire type round here. That's like, it must be really good. So I'm pretty sure I replaced Blazer Tour with it in the previous playthrough. I did notice like when we teleport, there was like a. Uh, Silhouette, so we're definitely missing one Coromon around this area. If I can find it before we get back, that'd be great. But luckily, it's not too far to run. Come on, and maybe we can find a potent again. So we did find a potent Blazer Tor, but <laughs> accidentally killed it. Oh, well, actually, it killed itself. It could attack me, I had Rocky Helmet on, I should have switched, but. Ah. Oh, Treon's kind of cute. Oh, okay, okay. Let me run. Thank you very much. Right. Come on, where's this fire type? Not potent, unfortunately. Or maybe I replaced my blazer tool with a potent blazer tool. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. Because I feel like I 
had a potent something. Oh! Oh, is this one of the new ones? This is the new Coromon. This looks awesome. Okay, I'm gonna catch this. I know they added two new Coromon to this update. I'm 99% I'm sure that is one of them. So we are gonna get this with a silver spinner. Hopefully. Whee! Nice, let's check out summary. So you are normal type. Cromwell raises its speed by one stage when consuming fruit. I kind of want to add it to the team, honestly. But the problem is, I don't know who to replace. Like, I like my team. I really do like my team. So at this point now, it's just like, I really like my team. And I don't know who I'm going to change. Like, it has to be a Cormon that I really, really love. Ah. Playing too many games recently, there's too many, like, options to use. So finally, it seems victory is mine yet again. Oh, there's a chest up there. Uh, yes, you're quite fast for an old man. So what is the final discipline? It is not the uh, knowing that is difficult, but the doing. Here, take this. White paint. Oh, a can of white paint and a brush. Paint? What do I need paint for? It's all on the wrist, Foltzy. Up and down, up and down. Return when the fences around the dojo are completely white. Okay. All right, let's grab the chest first. All right, what we got here? Pepper scent. All right, let's paint all these fences. Oh, do I have to keep doing it? Yeah. One coat is not good enough. Wait. Yeah, do this little bit here. I think again, actually. Yeah, that's one fence done. Looking good. Actually, this is this all the fence there is, or is there more to it? I'm sure it's like a little bit by the uh, left side. And last little bit. Is that it, or is there more? Oh, there's, yeah, there's more fences, yeah. Thought so. Let's keep going. I mean, it looks nice. That's a good color. So I think maybe like a red could have also been really nice. I don't know actually, I don't know about red. So red matches the little like, little decorative bit on top. I'm not sure if there's any more fences to the right. Just doing wax on, wax off. Oh, there's no paint the fences, like the up and down, isn't it? Yeah. And then wax on is like the, the circle motion. Was there any more? I remember like, wax on, wax off, paint the fence, and it seems you've missed it. Wait, missed a spot? One must, one must wax on, wax on again, and complete such tasks. Where have I missed? Right side? Oh no, down here. I see it, I see it. Missed this. All right. So this is the final thing we have to do, final discipline. Maybe they did get rid of the catch in the... I, I'm pretty sure you did catch like a potent or a catch like a Blazator or a Mino or something. Are we done? Oh, you have impressive fence painting skills. All right, now we can go inside for the final discipline. Oh, okay, I thought that was the final one. Wait a minute, wasn't this the final training? <laughs> training? Who said it was part of your training? Not I. This fence just needed a new lick of paint is all. Ah, <laughs> oh, now then, give me the paint. Okay, let us retire inside. Should've probably got healed up actually, but uh, fret not. We are nearly there, Voltsy. You've shown your competence in almost every discipline of my dojo. But now, ho ho ho, now, the time has come. You must face your master in a Koromon battle. Very well, Light Sensei, my Koromon and I are ready. Oh wait, oh, one should not jump to conclusions. This is no regular battle. Users of the Stonebreaker need to make wise decisions. Make them under all circumstances. You should not be allowed to use any items, and you shall only fight with Coromon you catch with my special spinners. Yeah, this is what I remember. Okay. One cannot fight with empty spinners, Light Sensei. Certainly not. You must uh, fill them yourself. Use those spinners to catch a new squad of three. You will not get the chance to train them, so strategize wisely based on the information you get on my squad. I will use a fire type, an ice type, and a water type. All are five levels higher than your squad. Okay, then I will go and catch three Coromon with these spinners. I will await your return, Voltsy. This is what I remember then. Okay, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. 
Wait a second. There's rooms here. Aha! Gonna get some uh, loot while we're at it. Uh, we train here not for the sake of beating up our enemies, but for enlightenment. However, sometimes I just need to vent. Then I feel like enlightening these dummies with my fists. Right, what else we got? Defense cake large and... Attack cake large. Nice. Alright, let's go to the right side and then we can uh, go and catch some Coromon. So we definitely got to catch a... Like a Blazer Tour. We've got to catch a Hound Trio. Got Golden Spinner, sweet. And then two more. Well, sorry, one more. But Gronin's styling a Bonsai helps us be a more calm and patient. Light Sensei, it says that our body can't grow stronger if the mind stays behind. Uh, before coming to this dojo, I was a mess. But Light Sensei changed my whole way of thinking. My whole way of living. Now I feel like I can take on the entire world. Is that a Street Fighter reference there, Ken? I haven't played Street Fighter in so long. Like, I, I loved Street Fighter 2. That's the only one I ever played. <laughs> Alright. Let's catch some Coromon, shall we? No, we don't want Mina. We want to get a good one. I'm not sure if we get to keep these, actually. I think there's like a bit of grass outside. Let's do it here. Oh yeah, we definitely want a blazer tour. Alright, so... Yeah, let's use this. I'm sure it'll be like a guaranteed catch, right? Yeah, nice. Alright, uh... That's good, two more to go. Alright, so we've got to get a Hound Trio. There you go. That's what we want. Or Hound Trion. Should say. And we've got like the Sensei Spinner. So now we've just got to deal with the fire type. I wonder if you say no to keeping the um the Coromon if it lets you get the the thing back, the spinner back for the um for another catch. I could probably go for like another Maybe another blazer tool if we get one with like um motivated. Could be good. I'm gonna keep going to our phone like uh maybe a know, maybe a potent. Or maybe get that new Coromon. Well there's the new one. Like the little version. I'm gonna catch one of these just because it's new. Well, so we've got the evolution of it, but I just want to get this, the little one. Ah, oh, you suck. Okay, uh, I'll take one of you out. Nice. I feel like I'm going to kill you, though. Don't kill it. I mean, it's 20 levels high, it's probably going to kill it. Yeah. For, cause I haven't put any stats in physical attack. Maybe it might live, but no, we're still, we're still so strong. But yeah, if we see the evolution of that, maybe I'll catch it. Uh, let's go for a plane spinning. Cause we know it's normal type. If we get lucky. Hey, there you go. Not bad. Oh, don't add to the team. Put it to storage. As long as I don't use the Light Sensei Spinner, we should be fine. Alright, one more, one more. Come on. Alright, I'm going to cut to when we find the third squad member we'll catch for uh, Light Sensei, unless this is it. No, alright, I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright, yeah, so we'll, we'll catch this. This should be good. And then we got a pretty decent squad, I think, for Light Sensei. Nice. See, I feel like I remember this being really annoying before. I, I, don't know, I don't know if it was like it wasn't guaranteed capture or maybe I just I kept getting terrible Coromon to uh, try and use. I don't remember. Uh, ooh. I'm going to get rid of Fast Strike for this. But yeah. Let's see how well this uh, squad will work out. Hopefully pretty good. Are you- Ah, you have returned. How did you fare in your search? I've decided on free Coromon, and I am ready to take you on with this squad. 
Well, I suppose it is time to commence the battle, Volksy. Take your position. No tricks. This is the true final test, Volksy. The culmination of all your training. If you win, you will have what it takes to master the Stonebreaker technique. Alright, let's go. Alright, we've got a switch. No way we stand against this. Oh, it's fine, it's fine. Let's go uh, multi-bolt. Nice, that's good, that's good. Love the battle background, that looks amazing. Uh, I think I could stand against this, to be honest. The multi-bolt. It's three times. Nope. Come on, man. If there's ever a time to hit three times, it's right now. It's twice. Come on, live this one last attack. Nice. Please finish it off. Oh, you had to hit once there. Alright. I don't know if this has motivated. I'm going to hope it does. Uh, let's go Phantom Spike. Should finish you off. Then we know the last one's Ice Type. Is that mo- no, that's the um, if we take it out with that we get the attack boost, so it's good. No motivated, but we should be able to heat haunt you. Yeah, we got this. Easy! <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Uh pick that up, doesn't matter. Not gonna stay on the team, we already got a blazer tour. Pretty decent one at that. Impressive, extremely impressive. I've been bested, fair and square. Voltsy, you are the first to master all the Stonebreaker dis disciplines. So quickly too. You're an example to my students. With the right mindset, anything is possible. Welcome all to Voltsy's Stonebreaker Ceremony. You came to this dojo as a tender green sapling with a sturdy foundation, but you leave here as a solid tree with mighty branches. You've mastered every discipline and have shown yourself worthy as, as my successor, as the new wielder of the Stonebreaker. I'm honored, Light Sensei. Awesome, well done. You deserve it. My dear Daniel, can you grab the Stonebreaker from the safe? What, the Stonebreaker technique is, a, is in a safe? Yes, after a certain age, one can no longer rely on their body. Instead, we can find assistance in technology. Ah, if I realized that sooner, I might have still kept in touch with Pele. Pele? Anyway, what are you waiting for, Voltsy? Install the module. Wait, you got a tremor. The tremor is great and powerful. It requires a capable wielder who can channel its force towards certain objects. That is what you have mastered, Voltsy. Perhaps even without your, without your knowing. In your hands, it is safe to use. So why don't you try it out? Uh, give the students a little show. Ooh! Behold, students! Voltsy has mastered the disciplines of Light Dojo and can now wield the Stonebreaker with ease. Does that reignite a fire in you, students? Perhaps it makes you wish to be stronger. So you best get back to training. Okay. Now you better get going, my fully grown bonsai. That boulder won't destroy itself. Right, so let's first get back. So we are gonna go, yeah, here. So we did find everything. Maybe I didn't switch the fire type round. I feel like I did. I don't remember. But anyway, before we go and break the rock, what we're going to do is we are going to go back in here. Because now we've got the Tremor. Stinky scent. Let's quickly go back. I think it's... Was it the previous room? Let's go around. I do love the music in here. I hope, like, the... Coromon team released like the, the final soundtrack to this. I'll totally buy it. So nice. Battle music. Some areas. Oh, so good. Alright, so was it this room? Was it near the start, actually? I think it might be near the start. Either way, it'll be good to check it out. Then we can just uh, Lux recall back. I it was on the left side, so... Let's go down another room. It's better be worth it, man. Better be worth it. Like I said, I honestly cannot remember what's inside. But I'll be just happy to remember. <laughs> so I tried to remember and, I, and it was something bad or good. I 
I just went past it. Oh, it'd be haunting me forever. Alright, I'm pretty sure it's this room. Yeah, there it is. Remember this? From the last episode? Well, now we can go Trimmer! Whee! We've got a chest. Skill flash. I'm sure there's like a cool Coromon you can get in there. Now let's go back. So it's just a skill flash. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Let's go back. See? Worth it. Skill flash. Alright, so let's get healed up first because I'm a little bit weak. I'm going to keep the little uh, headband on for the time being. Put the goggles back on later. Just for the time being, I think I look cool with the headband. Gotta let everyone know that I learned this from Light Sensei. But let's see, I'm, I'm more a fan of. Uh, hmm, actually, what am I a fan of? Miyagi Do. I think Eagle Fang. <laughs> so, Leo, it's time for a break. Do you want me to stop hacking, Voltsy? This here mine needs to be up and running again as soon as possible. Trust me, leave this to me. So, what do you mean? If I clear my mind? Center my focus, and then... Hey! <laughs> we good. That was the Stonebreaker. How? Why? Huh? <laughs> hey. I, I, I know, I do what I do. The boulder. It's like it wasn't even there. That was the... Oh, your pellet. Oh yeah, that's who you, uh, Light Sensei was talking about. But that was the unmistakable sound of the Stonebreaker. I knew it. But where did Light Sensei hide? Is he inside the mine? It was heckin' Voltsy over here! Voltsy destroyed that boulder in a snap of a zap! Yeah, you know, I'd do what I'd do. Come everyone, let's head inside, we have a lot of work to catch up on. I could thank you, but that wouldn't be doing you justice, Voltsy. Could give me some free stuff. <laughs> well, look, things are going to the barrel now. Uh, so Light Sensei, he really decided to pass on the Stonebreaker. Even if things weren't always great between he and I, I'm glad he found peace with a worthy successor. For all the great things Lux Solace is doing, he too must see that we should keep up with technology. If Light Sensei embraces technology, he should be fine with me upgrading the devices around here to the newest models. Finally, no more noise complaints. <laughs> Alright, into the mine we go to find the next Titan. Yo! You see this? Leo was real eager to get back to work, huh? How will I ever keep up with the endless pile? Guess this is my life now. <laughs> right. This is going to be... Oh, can't go through there. Do we have to go through on the mines to go through here? Or the mine carts? I think we do. Is that anything behind? No. Right, up we go. Hey, yo. I ain't going to waste a millisecond now that the mine is back in shape. I love it! <laughs> Alright, got a chest. Frigid scent. Okay. Uh, we're digging a shaft upwards instead of downwards now. Gravity is man's best friend. The minerals fall right into our carts. Why don't we think of this earlier? It's pretty smart, honestly. Oh, there's a room there, so let's... BAM! Grab this as well. Skill flash. Lots to explore. Ooh, what do... Wait, what's... Oh! Oh, nice! That's actually not bad. I don't mind having another one, honestly. Wait, what does this do? Cormon increases attack by 50% but can only use the first skill it uses in each... Uh, actually I'm going to keep... I'm going to put that onto Blazer Tor. Because all we need to use is heated horns and then we'll just be absolutely destroying everyone. But, uh, this can go on you for a little while. And going for this place once the... the stinky scent ends. Just want to be, uh... Hitting everything with the bubble blower. That's so good, man. Right. Can we take the car or are we just gonna... Oh, 600, nice. Complete accident. <laughs> Alright, down we go then. I can't remember the Fire Titan's name, but I feel like I remember the Fire Titan being pretty tough. And I know he's been buffed in this patch, so... Uh... Yeah, this is gonna be... This is gonna be fun. <laughs> Although we have got the water starter now, so maybe it'll be a lot easier. And it is very, very strong. 
So we make it rain, and we just go for a bubble blower. Maybe we can just like two shot it. I doubt we one shot it. We can you imagine if we did. <laughs> oh, yep. That sheer tooth actually did a lot to my megalobite. Uh, let's put your attack up. Oh, yeah, you are super dead, though. Bubble blower. No way I don't kill you, right? Nice. Nice, nice. Right, I think... Maybe I'll stop using Megalobite when he gets level 50. He's getting, uh, getting up there. Although, actually, I need to take off XP. I don't know, actually, I think it's... Yeah, when... Oh, wait. Then we push. When Ecliptor gets to 50, I definitely think I've got to take XP Sheriff and put it on, um... I forget what it's called now. Evolution of our bird? I forget what you're called. Whee! Wait a second. Wait a second. Let me go back. Let me go back. Whoop. I think I can walk up there. And walk through there. No, I can't go through that way. Okay, maybe not. But I can go up this way at least. Yeah, get a chest. Oh, Phoenix. Yeah, it was definitely worth it. That was 100% worth it. See, sometimes it's good to just uh, go back and explore. Found some good stuff. Oh, you want to fight? Every bit of experience I get around here would definitely be worth it. Always good to get as strong as possible for a Titan. Dark atmosphere. Alright, bubble blower. Oh, that looks terrifying. My defense, special defense is down a lot. I can't one-shot you, but it's okay, it's okay. And you're just gonna heal up. That's annoying. Don't do that again, please. Finish you off here. Nice, nice, nice. Ooh. Uh, let's go special attack. Level 49. Dude, we're getting so strong. Fiery breath. That's ah, a special. We're not we're not going special. That poison sucks. Ooh. Oh, it's not very effective. Okay, let's switch. Definitely go blazer tour. So I think you're ice, right? It looks icy to me. And heated horns. <laughs> and then we get the motivated, get that attack up. Oh, dude, we are so strong. Wait, what's this? Uh, Chroma moves so fast that it seems as if illusions. Since oh, okay. Uh, special, though, that's the. Problem. Make it physical. Yeah. Right, heated horns. Oh, this thing is tanky. It looks so good though. Like, I'm not done. I feel like I wish I kind of got one to use. Looks like an absolute tank, man. Should have gone to like up to like defense and special defense. Use it just to like, you know, tank hits. Get our tanky boy. Man, that was tough. We got a lot of experience there. More attack. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, so we've got three minecarts to take. Oh, yep, definitely tremor there. Remember this puzzle getting a little bit complicated later on with all the uh do things you gotta do. An extra XP after participating. Oh, okay. Have we got any space for this? It's like a lucky egg this is. Put on you for now. <laughs> Why not? Oh, we're gonna get so strong. So strong. I saw a bone, that little bone there. I was thinking, oh, I need to go and pick that up. I was thinking of a different game for a second. It's been on the hunt for bones so much. Right, where's this taking us all? Oh. Way chests. Golden spinner. And skill flash. Heat wave. Whee! 
<laughs> Back we go. I like minecart puzzles when you got like change the tracks and stuff and try to figure out where you're going. Like I said, they can get a little bit complicated when you gotta like move multiple different tracks. So I guess we're gonna go down there. I should talk to you in case you wanna fight. Dude, just for a small rock, but I couldn't even hear it, it hit the bottom. How deep is the endless cavern of darkness? Very deep. Checkpoint reached. Ooh. Bit of a quake. Can we break these? No. I kind of hope you can break the little wooden crates. Can you imagine we took that one? Bam! We'll be, uh, one dead little Voltsy. We don't want that. Uh, what do we got here? Hey, two trick spinners! Let's go! Hey, oh! So, what did the miner say about his workplace? It's all mine! <laughs> that was a good joke. Wait, what? That's an old miner joke passed down for centuries. Ah, it's pretty good, man. It's pretty good. I like it. Whoa! Oh, you know what? That looks sick! That actually looks really cool. Is that a new Coromon? I don't ever remember seeing that, but I want to I get it. I'm going to assume we find that in the... Um, the next area, because the next area is the snowy area. I am so gonna. Oh, nice. Oh, I got the burn. I don't know who I'm gonna replace, but I want that on the team. I like that. Uh. Let's go Tora Vault. Let's go Multi Bolt. Sweet. Uh, Treon, let's switch to Dove Terra. The magnitude. Ouch, got a crit on me? That's not cool. Right, size my wave gone. Big number. Big number. Don't know what number we got, but we're gonna have to kill you in one hit at least. Oh, special attack. Grimask. Oh. I like it, but it's just, it's just the face creep. Like, I think it's the teeth that freak me out. The rest of the design, absolutely love. Face man, the teeth, the little chitter chatter, creepy. Oh, and one more multi bolt to take you out. Nice. All these levels are getting are so good. Goldbeak, that's you. I need to remember your name, Goldbeak. I think maybe I don't know if I want to replace Goldbeak because I really like it. It's got a really good move set. Oh, okay, you're gone. I'm gonna go across this. And then we hit this. Here we go. Now the puzzle's starting to change. Whee! <laughs> and then we got another chest here. Oh, I forgot. We need to catch. Um, I'm gonna catch this because actually, I do kind of like it. But we need to get a. Um, uh, I think it was called the eye, the multi. I'm pretty sure you get him in here. Get him in here. We need to get one for the side quest for Jack. If you remember, like, I think it was the second episode, maybe the third one. We saw uh, the dude in the the house all alone in the in the forest. He was sad about his uh, Coromon. Oh, this is where he can catch a multi. I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's multi. Oh wow, that looks so cool, potent. Oh, that's actually banging. Purple and the yellow just looks really nice. If I find one of those potent, I'm definitely going to add one to the team. Again, don't know who I'll replace. Probably have to be Blades at all. Keep it balanced, but... Man, it's cool. Right, so we got... Let's go this way first before we do anything. This takes us directly across. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! <laughs> Alright, so we don't want to do that. And then we don't want to go down the next one, because that will kill us. So we want to go like this. Okay. There's two to take here. Let's go this one first. I feel like this is going to get me killed if I... We're not doing that. That's that's one way to die. 
we just go back. And then we take this one. I don't want to die. Alright, hit this. This is across that way. Oh, see, it's getting a bit complicated now with all the different routes we can take. So this lets us get across there. Oh, we good, we good. And we get a chest out of this. Alright, so there's two switches. This one lets us go down there. This one keeps us alive. Alright, let's take it. Whee! And we're gonna go deeper down. Checkpoint reached, fantastic. Oh, come on, multi. Oh, wow. I think this is what I must have used before. This looks amazing. If you live this, I might catch you. Nope, okay. I feel like I must have used that before. I love the look of that. I feel like that's something I would have used. But right now, I think the, what, the only common I definitely have my eyes set on is that ice goat looking thing. Oh boy, another shake. The last one was just a couple seconds ago. The quicks are really um, closing in on each other. This can't be safe for very long. Time to flee. Yeah, I was going to say, you should probably leave. <laughs> oh, don't know. Although I don't recognize you, you seem pretty weak. A quick victory won't hurt. <laughs> oh, you know what? You know, this place looks dangerous. I could, like, get you know, buried alive, burned to death. Uh, but you know what? A battle. A battle seems like a great idea. Oh, dude. Let's hope we do some big damage to you. Nice. And one more finish you off. Ouch. Uh -huh. Wait. Okay, that's one down. Megalobite's getting so ready for uh, the Fire Titan. Oh, your animation is kind of cool. I got a switch. Oh no, Dog Terror is dead. Wait. Oh yeah, we're actually pretty weak right now. I'm just gonna go for a little bit of damage. I'll get. Oh, I got no SP. All right, there's no point switching then. It's gonna see if we can maybe live. Probably not. And then we'll go into Cliptor. We'll go for Soul Crush. Not bad. Gonna try a Shadow Runner, so much damage this does. Pretty good, pretty good. And one more finish you off. We yeah, outspeed you, which is nice. I think I've probably got to definitely get healed up for the next fight. Oh, dude, I do like this a lot. I think this is what I caught. All right, I wanted the um, like the Crimsonite version because like the the Crimsonite on it looks so so cool. But now you can get a skin. So I catch this, I can like get the skin for it. I do like it, but I, I don't know. I'm more like in the uh, is it, was it goat ram? The other ice one. I want to get that. Oh, I've got to get SP back. Come on, come on, please don't kill me. Yeah, we fine, we fine. Now let's go for a Shadow Runner. Ooh. Good battle, dude, good battle. Uh, what's this? User crashes recklessly in the target with its head, dealing great damage, user suffers first and recoil damage though. Oof, no thanks. No, thank you. Yep, you better run. Okay, really time to book it. The end is nigh. Yeah, probably smart. Alright. Uh, let's see. So this... Oh, there's a Titan. Oh, what does the sign say? I can't read the sign. So that takes us that way. What if we do this? It takes us that way. I don't know which way we want to go just yet, but let's just take this and see where it goes. Okie dokie. Still haven't found a multi yet. Oh! <laughs> there you go! 
<laughs> oh man. I haven't found a multi yet. Bam! Next encounter multi. Alright. This is what we want to catch for the side quest. So once we finish this... Okay. Once we finish this uh, main quest, we'll go and hand this in. A nice gold spinner. Can we get you now? Okay. I don't want to kill you. Just going for a normal spin. Maybe we'll get lucky. Come on. There you go. Doesn't get caught in a uh, fire spinner. Doesn't get caught in a um, a golden spinner. Gets caught in a plane spinner though. <laughs> oh, my luck sometimes of catching Coromon is not good. Oh, hot spinners, nice. Okay, got lots of switches over here. If I find a potent one of these, I definitely want to use it. I think it looks awesome. All right, so where does this take us? To death. Okay. So let's see what this does. That lets me go across that way. That brings me down. That brings me across. I don't think I do this one. Oh, oh, have I done it? Hey! Okay, I've got to get healed up though. We are way too weak right now. I mean, luckily, I've got a bunch of shards. Alright, then we'll use the cakes. Mm, let's use the combi cakes. Get a bit more SP as well, it was always nice. Alright, then we'll go for less SP cakes. Don't really want to waste all these, but hold on to them for a bit. Yo, you again. Okay, I, I'm prepared this time. Here it comes. What do you call a bent pickaxe? Oh no, I missed it. Ah, it went. Didn't catch well. Are you kidding me? I don't know what he said. Ah. Oh, you got purple. That looks, it looks really cool purple. All right, I'm going to go for the rain first. Fine, then we go for a bubble blower. Oh, that's nice damage. Next one will finish you off. Go on, have a fire type. I know you want to have a fire type next. Yeah, definitely got 140 special attack. And then obviously grow a level and don't want that. Uh, who's this? Oh, that's special. I feel like Doug Terra. Probably should have a special attack up instead of attack. I mean, there's some great, um, great moves that learn, but I feel like I can have attack or special. I feel like there's a lot more special for us to actually use. Okay, okay, it's fine. Seismic wave, big damage, please. Magnitude six. Ooh, okay, that was like 47 as well, that was. It's getting tough. All right, so what does this do? This let's just go across there. All right, so now we want to go back. Also, now that we've got the multi, I'm gonna pop a stinky scent just for the time being. So I can try and figure this out. We've got what we need. I think I want to go to the right now. Because I assume that one down below takes us to the Titan, but we've got to figure out the track first. Right, so what do we got around here? Got a cool looking skull. Oh! Hey! Found a skill flash on it. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, chest. Recall, which don't really need. 
No, you want to fight? Yes, you do. So I heard there are more Taruga somewhere around. Oh, Taruga? I want them. I need them. Let me show you. The Let me show you their strength. I mean, like, if I caught one, I'd I kind of would want to use one at the same time. But I've used one before, and I don't know. I, I feel I used to love using all three starters on, on my team. Like one of the things I used to do, like growing up as a kid, me and my friend when the Pokemon game would first come out, get our link cables, put them up, and then one of us would keep starting again, a game again and again and again, so we get all the starters. Like I'd start it again, what, five, six times, so that I can get um, all the starters traded over, and then trade them back the ones I need back to me, and start the game off with all three. But now I'm like, I kind of like just like having the one. Having all three, having all three is nice, but when you just got the the one starter, it's just I don't know, it's it's, it's nice. It feels more special. So now it leaves you open to use other things. All right, can I grab? Oh, I can grab this. Let's go like that. Combi cake large. That's good. Uh, yeah, want to go across. down this way. Where's this taking us? I don't know, but I see some chests. Grab that. SP cake large. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So that gets us across. Yeah, definitely want to do that. I feel like we're doing alright with this minecart. Oh, look at that over there. Well, the multis. And that's probably going to take us down, right? Yeah, because otherwise we would die. So there we go. Now we can go towards the Titan. I'm not sure we've got to fight the Multis, but I'm going to just heal up just in case. So I don't know if it's going to take us directly to the uh, the Titan. So probably a good idea just to do this. Right. Uh... I've got plenty of these. I'm just going to do this. Love these combi cakes. Alright. Let's also save the game. Just in case things go poorly. Probably use the milestones real quick. Oh. Sweet. Uh, claim you. Whoa. That gave me a lot. Whoa. Okay. Oh, Phoenix Stones are good. Hey, what's this? Gold Lump. What does the Gold Lump do? An extra gold? Oh, that's actually really nice. Okay, let's go. Titan time! Different potent multis. Whee! Down we go. I'm ready for it, I think. Finally, you have arrived. His name's Hosei. Hey, Hosei. Where you at, buddy? Oh. This can't go on like this. So what do you mean? Did I do something wrong? No, not you. Those blasted Wabonians. They've gotten their hands on drilling pods and are drilling towards Chow Chewy as we speak. They're attacking a titan? I'll go there at once. Stop! You must stay away, for now. Venturing there without properly training at both your strength and resolve could have disastrous consequences. The odds are heavily stacked against you. Crimsonite is spreading like wildfire, infecting countless Coromon and even humans. Oh. Preserver, we can't afford to let you loose on uh, even one fight, for the faith of our planet is tied with the core stone you carry. Just like us, Chow Chewy has her own battle ahead. Let us concentrate on strong, on storing the remaining elemental types into the core stone. That is the most effective way we can help her. May your inner fire blaze as fiercely as my flames, Foltsy. You are undoubtedly needed. Come on then, show me your worth. Let us face off in the heat of battle. Alright, here we go. Dude looks so cool. That pose. The Bonians, they're making a move on my sister. So, what are you waiting for? Alright, first things first. Monsoon! Punch? Okay, yeah. 
You call yourself a Titan with that? This is a true Titan power. Ooh, 170 there. Let's keep going. Oh, let's go. Your essence. Okay, okay. Well, I still control my element. Let me put it to good use. Oh, okay, okay. It's fine. I'm gonna get rid of that. I like it rainy, my dude. I like it rainy. Oh, what? You know what? Fine. Don't want to fight my uh, my water type. Got some seismic waves. Oh, I actually does quite a bit. It's fine. I'm gonna go for a tricky claws next, I think. Critical hit, sweet double critical hit. All right, let's go Tora Vault. Let everyone else have a bit of fun. Lower your SP. All right, it. That's fine. Rain stops. So you're finally getting fired up. But can you also enjoy my extreme heat? Oh, okay. Oh, what? Oh my gosh, everyone's SP gone. You suck. You know what? Fine. Fine. I was gonna play nice. But you wanna be like that? Yeah, give it that rocky helmet. Bring us back to uh, putting the rain up. My megalobite is gonna destroy you, son. I was gonna have a bit of fun, give you a fair fight, but now. Nah! You can uh, fight my megalobite in a fair fight. What well, an unfair fight for you. <laughs> Alright, one more should finish you off. Megalobite, absolute legend. Goodbye, Huzai. He's he! <laughs> oh, megalobite, you're an absolute monster. Yes, yes, the strength. This is all burning deep within you. It's exactly what we need to reach my sister on time. But make sure to gather the ice essence before you face the terrors of Crimsonite in... Is Quan? I don't know how you want to say that, but... Only through the reunion of all six of our types in our birthstone can we unlock the ability to weaponize the elements of our planet. I shall join my brethren with the core stone, but you must hurry, Faulty. Chow Chewie won't hold out forever. I'm trying. I don't remember the core stone in the original story. I need to check if that was actually there, but my brother Vorst resides nearby. Reunite us fast before more innocent souls fall to the carnage of Crimsonite. Go now. Go. Make great haste. And we're out. Whoa. Hey, Vaultsy. You look a bit pale. Still not used to the earthquakes, are you? No, it's... I need to hurry on with my mission. Things are more, more time critical than before. Can you tell me the quickest way to the eastern Batavi Mountains? I have no time to lose. Ah, I was right. Being the adventurous type you are, I already anticipated you were heading to uh, Alavi. So while you were in Mount Muspel, I rigged up a new fancy stabilizer for our cable carts. They're now fully quake-proof. No applause needed. But you get one anyway, you get one anyway. So the town's revenue seems to be recovering thanks to you. So go and use our cable carts anytime, Faulty, free of charge. They're just uh, to the east of town. You can't miss them. They're pretty much the only man-made thing there. All right, we'll do. On to the next invention. See ya. And if I see you first. All right. With that though, I think it's probably a great place to end this part off. Next episode, we will uh, head to the snowy mountains and hopefully get a new team member as well. Want to get that uh, ice goat-looking thing? Make sure we save the game. I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace.